You know, the last Forbidden List, I thought they did a great job hitting some of the problematic cards and preventing players from FTKing and allowing FTKs to be consistently, you know, abrupt inside of this format. But only longer and longer we find ourselves into the stars, deep into space, figuring out more FTKs because the problematic cards never left. Am I getting a little bit too far? All right. I'm the Cali Effect, and if you guys want to see more videos like this, then go ahead and destroy that subscribe button. But more importantly, go ahead and FTK that notification bell, because, well, we just too strong. I want to give a special shout out to every sing single one of my Patreons. Without you, videos like this would not be possible. I really do appreciate it. Also, another special shout out to Alex Wiener. He actually put me on game of this combo, and he was like, hey, Cali, I just want to make a good deck. I don't want to FTK, but we're, we're going to FTK. I'm sorry. We just have to do it. Without further ado, I present to you, yes, Cosmos can actually FTK. I see it in the stars. It's all in the alignment. Okay, so I know you guys are seeing a whopping six cards right here. It's not necessarily a six-card combo. Kind of like a four-card combo. I just decided to use the Metal Foe cards to, to mitigate this. Now, for this combo, you are going to need Overdrive Teleporter, Tune Table of Contents, and Brain Researcher Lab, as well as a way to summon or to get Overdrive Teleporter to your field. It can be Emergency Teleport, and then Tribute for the Overdrive Teleporter. It could be a Pendulum Summon, which I'm doing right now, or it could even be Mausoleum of the Emperor, whichever you choose. I'm going to start off with the Pendulum Route by activating two monsters into the scale and Pendulum Summoning for Metal Foe's Gold Driver, and then Tributing it for the summon of Metal Foes or Overdrive Teleporter. Now your Overdrive Teleporter needs to be in right under an extra monster zone for what we're about to do. Activate the Brain Research Lab, then pay 2,000 life points, psych not, because we have Brain Research Lab, to special summon two psychic monsters to our side of the field, those two being Cosmos Sword Troopers. Use both of those Sword Troopers for a Link Summon for your Akashic Magician, and trigger off your Akashic Magician's effect to bounce the overdrive teleporter back into your hand. Use your Brain Research Lab's ability to gain you a second summon, tributing the Akashic Magician back for overdrive teleporter, this time placing it in a monster scale that is not, well actually it doesn't really matter, it can be in anything as long as you don't hog up your monster, extra monster zone. Then use overdrive teleporter's effect again, paying, well nothing because Brain Research Lab, to special summon Cosmo Sword Troopers, and a metal foe silver it to your side of the field. Now it's very important once you start using Cosmo Sword Troopers effect that you summon this Sword Troopers and you summon this Sword Troopers, I'm sorry, you summon a Sword Troopers to this zone and then you summon the last Sword Troopers to your extra monster zone. So these two Sword Trooper monsters effects have been used and we have two more counters on Brain Research Lab. Next, we're going to use Overdrive Teleporter and our Cosmo Sword Troopers as well as silver it the effects that we have used for a link summon of, guess what, the card that normally constitutes for FTKs, Firewall Dragon. Fortunately for us, Firewall Dragon isn't the end-all be-all. If it were banned, it would make this FTK a lot harder, but it isn't the reason why we need it so much. We're going to use Cosmo Sword Troopers effect to pay another thousand, putting this at six counters. And let me represent that that card effect has been used. And then our second Cosmo Sword Troopers effect to pay another a uh, thousand life points and representing that that card has been used to summon our last sword trooper so you guys are starting to get what we're gonna do we're gonna activate tune table of contents for tune table of contents for tune table of common sense it doesn't matter then ending up with tune cannon soldier from our hand the last thing we're gonna do is use both of these cosmos sword troopers for a link summon of any link to it does not matter we just get the tribute trigger off our firewall dragon's effect spell summoning tune cannon soldier to our side of the field from here it should be relatively simple to know what we're going to do sword troopers effect to summon sword troopers sword troopers effect to summon sword troopers again and now we can start cobbling off toon cannon soldier tribute for 500 for 500 so that's 1000 then that's sword troopers to activate both of their effects placing two more counters on this making it five and then placing two more and then toon cannon soldier to tribute off for another thousand we can continue to cycle until our opponent does not have any more life points sword troopers for sword troopers sword troopers for sword troopers tributing off sword two sword troopers to inflict damage over and over again and because we have brain research lab um it's gonna place counters instead of us taking damage for cosmos sword troopers effect initially resulting into an ftk 
which is downright ridiculous now you do have to play a couple of different cards from the metal folk cosmo deck and i'm thinking about actually i am going to make a deck profile for this for patreon exclusive members so if you guys want to see it first and before anyone else being a patreon member will be the best thing and if this video gets 150 likes then yes i will release it for everyone to see um just a little bit of incentive to be a patreon and then for the people that can't afford it just go ahead and give this video a like it lets me know that you guys want to see videos like this it's been pretty awesome to play Yu-Gi-Oh, but apparently we're not going to be doing any of that um Ka toon cannon soldier being able to continuously tribute off our monsters and special summon sword troopers and sword troopers being able to continuously supply monsters to our side of the field for the tribute of toon cannon soldier thank you guys so much for watching another segment of the cali effect if you guys have any combo ideas any insane combos then go ahead and let me know another thing that i actually want to point out is that if our opponent ghost ogres our brain research lab we're screwed which is the reason why uh, alex wanted to make like an extra link but i'm like man if they just put two destructions on the field you know one being to stop our tri-gate wizard and the other one to get rid of brain research lab we lose but so i just figured the ftk again thank you guys so much for watching another segment of the cali effect please like comment subscribe i want to know what you guys think of this ftk as well if you guys have any other uh, ideas just post them down in the uh, in the discord put them in the comment section or you can just message me on facebook please like comment subscribe but most of all enjoy i hope you guys are having a great day like i am